China Congress begin the latest key economic figures as leaders meet. China has delayed the release of its latest economic growth figures, figures which were due to be published as the Communist Party's leadership gathers. The National Bureau of Statistics the National Bureau of Statistics did not give a reason for delay. The decision has been described as very rare by Epper and is seen by some as a sign of further weakness in the world's second largest economy. President Xi Jinping is expected to be confirmed for a historic third term on this week's party congress in Beijing. According to an update in BS calendar, publication of several key economic indicators, indicators including third quarter growth domestic product GDP had been postponed. A new date for the release of the figures has yet to be scheduled. Pushman Dot, an economics professor and in seat university told the BBC the delay was a very rare event, and the Chinese government had released data as scheduled through the pandemic. My only guess is that those numbers will not be very good and would not lead to the object of doubling to Chinese economy. In the time span the President Xi announced, he said. Meanwhile, Dan Wang Chief Economics and Han Xin Bak Shina believes the delay may not necessarily be because of disappointing economic data. The normal procedure of signing of those data may have been disrupted as all top leadership are occupied during the pandemic, she said. Mr. Xi signaled on Sunday that there will be no immediate loosening, loosening on his controversial zero-COVID strategy, which has weighed it on China's economic growth. GDP measures the size of an economic. Gauging its expansion on contraction is one of the most important ways of measuring how well or badly an economy is performing and is closely watched by economists and central banks. China previously indicated that it may miss its annual economic growth target of 5.5%. The Politburo, the ruling Communist Party's top policy-making body, did not mention the official growth target in a statement after its quarterly policy meeting in July. Instead, it said it aimed to keep growth within a reasonable range. Iris Peng, Greater China Chief Economist and in 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 Bank, she said she expects that China third quarter GDP data would not paint an optimistic picture. This data delay shows that the government thinks that the 20 party congress is the most important thing happening in China and would like to avoid other information that could create mis message to the market, she told the BBC.